Checking in with downtown Lyman, the Veterans Memorial Civic and Convention Center, and the CEO, Abe Ambrose, is with us today. And thanks for joining us, Abe. You bet. Thanks for having me. We are on a countdown because we got a lot of great things happening here in the, right in the middle of the end of summer, man. We do. We do. <laughs> we keep it going. It's great. Yeah. All right. So in July, great classic rock concert coming. Yeah. Tesla is just such a great rocking show. I mean, it's this is one I've really been excited about. We've got uh, you know a great partnership with Honeywell Arts. They're the ones bringing Tesla in here, and it's just going to be a great night of rock. Um, you know, I, I, I keep calling Tesla. They're, to me, they're like the cool 80s band that you can yeah. wear to anything. You can wear yeah. them to a Pearl Jam concert. You could wear them to a <laughs> Def Leppard concert, and you fit in. It's just, it's, it's a, they're a great band. They are, they reach all the edges of spectrum. If you're a rock fan, that mm -hmm. you should like Tesla. Yeah. They, if you don't know night. them, Google them and listen to their songs. Yeah. Then you want to go to the concert. Yeah, absolutely. That's for sure. Definitely. <laughs> we're, and we're selling a lot of tickets, so we don't have a lot of tickets left. Oh, so hurry. But hurry, yeah. Okay. If you want to go, hurry. All right. Another one that should be neat. I mean, this guy's coming to town to sing his dad's songs, Croce. Yeah. You know, Croce plays Croce. It's, uh, it's a really cool concept and and it's and, you know great for AJ to do this you know you know sometimes you know artists kind of get like I want to be my own guy right. you know like Bob Dylan Jacob Dylan and, you know all that stuff that has mm -hmm. happened but you know AJ recognizes that you know Jim Croce was a fantastic performer he was his dad and they did have a good connection a lot of Jim Croce's music videos have AJ in them oh, I didn't um, that mean. so yeah I mean they've had a great they, they had a great connection uh, fortunately Jim Croce's not with us anymore uh, but AJ's gonna go out there and play a lot of those hits you know bad bad Leroy Brown and I mean you can mm -hmm. name them off there's, yeah, exactly. there's a whole bunch of them right um so it's yeah it's a it's a great night aj's really talented uh and if you want to hear that croce music it's a great opportunity all right very good and then we've been counting down for the amphitheater to open the pavilion yeah. so do we still have tickets for those shows the we do grand opening we do fortunately i mean that space is is big you know i think if you drive by it, you may not really understand it until you get out there and you can see really how much room there there is going to be as far as capacity um so we're actually even keeping that capacity below what um we're told our capacity is uh -huh. because it's our opening weekend yeah, so we want to test it yeah, out <laughs> we want to test it out we want to figure some things out so we'll you know we'll have chairs so if you're on the seat map um, online and you're picking out a chair you might look out there there's no chairs out there right now well there's not right now but August 3rd 4th and 5th there will be and we're going to be putting them the same places they are on that seat map so if you're choosing a seat in a specific row and a location that seat row location will be there and it'll be marked and you'll be able to get there mm -hmm. um, if you if you just want to go out there and bring your own chair and sit in the lawn the south part of the of the quad of the park is going to be that where you can bring in your own chair just don't have a high umbrella or something that's going to obstruct people's view okay all right and so those concerts are going on but also other things are going to be happening during the weekend too, yeah, right? There's all kinds of free events going on outside of the amphitheater as well. So um, there's, there's going to be some food trucks. There's going to be cornhole. There's going to be bouncy houses. Um, there, you know, we've got this group from Allen Lime Leadership that really wanted to enhance the opening weekend. Um, and of course, Rotary's getting involved, and I'm trying to help as well with mm -hmm. what we can do. At, you know, with uh, so that's um, going to be a big weekend yeah. downtown, isn't it? It yeah. absolutely is. We're really excited about it. You know, these shows, August third, fourth, and fifth, are you know you have to pay to get into those concerts, uh, but we are trying to do some free shows throughout the year as well you know maybe more so next summer mm -hmm. um, this year we're still working on potentially doing kind of a soft opening the week the Thursday before this with one of our curtain calls we oh, might nice. actually have that at the amphitheater so that would be a free concert out at the amphitheater and we are definitely planning the Thursday after this so August 10th is going to be a free show at the amphitheater it's gonna be our final curtain call of the summer with uh, Bubba and Friends featuring Kino. So awesome. that's that's always a really popular show. And so you're talking about curtain calls. Until those two, mm -hmm. they'll be in the little intimate uh, Happy Days patio area, though, yeah. until then, right? Yeah, and yeah. That, that's such a fun location, too. Like it, Next summer, we're going we're gonna to still be using the Happy Days patio. We're not going to be moving these all over to the amphitheater. It's just kind of because it's that opening. We want to utilize yeah, sure. it more. But yeah, the Happy Days patio, it's right next to the Wingate. It's really a cool location. Um, it started off as kind of like that speakeasy feel where people didn't couldn't find it. Um, now, and once they found it, they were part of the <laughs> club. Yeah, really. um, but yeah, more and more people are coming. It's a chance to, you know, give local artists a chance to perform in front of an audience. We have free food and we have a cash bar. It's a, it's a lot of fun on a Thursday. All right. And a lot of other things happening too. Check your website to get the details. Yeah, a lot of stuff happening. LimaCivicCenter.com. Right. Thank you, Abe, for coming. You bet. Thank you. All right. Don't go away. New edition continues in a moment.